Graham, here we are, sort of halfway through the Autumn Internationals and um, pretty good record for Tigers with the international players away. Yeah, we've had a good run. Um, I think Leicester's sort of club have prided itself on, you know, despite the fact that guys will go missing, that we sort of, you know, the players who come in are as good and able to do exactly the same job as the guys who are missing. Um, I think we proved that against Saints where, you know, they lost obviously a few players as well, but we came out on top and looked the better team um, just because, you know, those guys who came in know their jobs just as well and were able to perform just as well. So I think, and then the LVs, so we slightly disappointed against Saris, we put out a young side and obviously Saris had a few experienced players. Um, I think the Maori game was a massive positive for us. Um, if you look, they've only lost a couple of times in, I don't know, five or six years. So to get the win against those guys who played sort of Super 15 rugby and are quality players, I think shows you know, the determination that we've got. And, um, and then again at the weekend, it was an excellent, excellent win. You know, Irish put out pretty much their full strength team. Um, and, you know, we. I think we dominated them really from where I was sitting. Um, so it's yeah, three positive games really. Yeah, um, sort of almost two different line lineups for the the Maori game and the London Irish game. But what does that say about the squad and the fact that everybody in the squad is playing their part? Mm, oh, like I say, I think Leicester. That's one of the things Leicester prides itself on. Yeah, it's it's inevitable. Guys will go missing at these times of year, but it's uh, you know you do the work all through the year. I mean, I know when last year when I wasn't playing. A lot of the time you're still working hard, you're still training hard and you're still pushing to get in the squad and when you do get the opportunity, like we've seen in the last couple of games, guys step up and take it and it provides a good result for us. Yeah, the squad will be tested again at the weekend away at London Watson. They're going well, aren't they? Yeah, I'm, I'm beating at home this season. They've got a dangerous back three um, and well, a decent pack. Um, so it's, it's going to be a test and we know that. Um, and again, if you guys are missing, you've got guys coming in who haven't played much, but... I'm sure they'll be up to the challenge and hopefully we'll get the win. Do you enjoy Adams Park? Is it a ground that you've got a good record on? Not at all, no. I think I've played there four times, lost all four times, so I'm hoping I can change that <laughs> this weekend. Um, but no, I think I've had some pretty heavy defeats there as well. It was where I made my debut when I was 18. I think they put 50 passes that day. Obviously last year we lost um, and then a couple more times at Worcester we've lost there as well. So. Hopefully, hopefully we'll put that right this weekend.